Two agriculture workers along with their baby have died and 13 others have been injured after a pickup truck carrying workers crashed in the southern Turkish province of Gaziantep. Halil Alm and his wife Husni Yi Alm, two agriculture workers originally from the southeastern province of Anlurfa, died at the scene as a pickup truck carrying 16 people, mostly agriculture workers, turned over following a tire blowout near Gaziantep's Natip district on July 14. The Alm family's one-year-old toddler Esma was taken to the Natip public hospital for treatment, but her life could not be saved. All the 13 injured, including the driver, were related to each other, sharing the same last names of Alm and Dodu. The pickup truck was heading from the Rehanel district of the southern province of Hatayi to Anlurfa at the time the crash occurred on the Ghazi on Tep Anlurfa Highway. The bodies of Halil and Husni Yi Alm were taken to the local forensic medical institution for examination following the initial inspection of the scene. The highway was temporarily closed to traffic as the workers' possessions were strewn across the road after the crash. Turkey has seen a rising toll of agriculture worker deaths in recent months, with the July 14 crash marking the second of its kind so far in 2015. As many as 15 agriculture workers, 13 of whom were female, died in another pickup truck crash in the Aegean province of Manisa on July 6. In a separate crash last year, 18 agriculture workers lost their lives as a minibus carrying a group of seasonal agricultural workers turned over in the southern province of Isparta on October 31, 2014. At least 646 workers died in Turkey in the first five months of 2015, according to a report released on June 2 by the Worker Health and Work Safety Assembly, SGM, a non-profit platform that deals with worker health and safety issues. The number of agriculture sector workers who died in May alone was at least 39, the report states.